just watching Lanky Box, guys, right? And then I saw this. Cory Tongue now. First mook. Now it's Cory Tongue. Please don't be humor on it. I'm going to choose the faction tonight. You're choosing now. You have three races to choose from. Fine. First up, L. Bro, why are you... Why are you doing the sussing? Why did they both get to Whatever. They sing always upon the banks of their stream. But they have weird ears. Elves use magic to build resplendent Ferdinand citadels with unshakable walls by crisscrossing vines and inscribing the history of their kingdom on floating monuments. Oh, come on, can I have something more menacing? Find that forest. You're doing. Stop using that stupid dance. Get again. Oh, leave me alone. The orcs will resound through the mountains and rivers. I do like their fashion style. Anyways, orcish cities are brashly decorated, festooned with sharp tusks, leering like an open jaw of a bloodthirsty giant. Filling on lookers with fear. A bit too much. Don't we have humans? Make up your mind. Seriously, is everything okay? <sighs> I just loved it, all right? The humans till the fields of the plains. So they're farmers? Oh, shop. They're crucial to the world, bro. Human buildings are made from wood and stone, warmed by wood burning on a roaring hearth, built with mathematical precision. There, all right? Yeah. Corey, just be quiet. Look, in the end, let's be honest, it's all about the humans. Who? You really are clueless, eh? Once your allies have captured a behemoth, it's yours to keep. Name it, then work with your allies to train it. They might or whatever. They not be the gentlest of pets, but they'll make up for it in battle. So what you're saying is, I instantly win. No, what I'm saying is, in a large-scale warfare, behemoths are an indispensable secret weapon. Choose the right behemoth, shove it out on the battlefield, and then let the painstaking training pay off as your behemoth lays waste to your enemies. Okay, so I'm gonna be a fairy. Nothing. There's no fairies. Did you not hear anything I No, I actually don't care about that. Dragon? You need to choose between elves, humans, or... At least I have a dad. Dragons are the most powerful creatures across all of Tamaris. In the face of complete destruction, the wearing people of Tamaris have been brought together in an uneasy alliance. <laughs> oh, what the heck? Yeah, that was born anyways. Subscribe if you think this is cringe.